Hi, I'm Shamel Amar, Head of Science and Technology for the Vegetarian Butcher, which is part of Unilever. The plant-based foods and proteins transition is important to me in my company role, but more so in my role as father of two daughters. We all want a world that is safe, which means, amongst others, a world where sufficient nutrition is available for everyone. Between now and 2050, the demand for good quality proteins will grow tremendously. And we'll si we will simply not be able to fulfill that demand using our current food and agricultural system. Unilever has a responsibility here as well. Our future foods commitments include achieving 1 billion plant-based meat and dairy sales, halving our food waste, doubling the number of products that deliver positive nutrition, and continue to lower calories, salt and sugar. In this journey, we want to collaborate with like-minded partners. When it comes to research for the vegetarian butcher, we particularly like to collaborate on improving sustainability and nutrition of plant-based diets. More specifically, I'm thinking of topics like protein diversification, improving the accuracy of life cycle analyses, agreeing on nutritional and environmental product labels, milder processing and the use of more natural ingredients. The European Commission could be more supportive by breaking down barriers for those wanting to play a commercial role in the plant-based foods area. When I say this, I do not primarily talk about Unilever. I'm talking about smaller companies. The European Commission could do a lot more, for instance, for farmers and startups. They could anticipate more on regulatory and financial barriers. They could stimulate farmers that currently work with livestock to make the transition to growing plant proteins. Startups, they could provide with more financial options to attract high quality employees and make regulatory procedures more simple to allow quicker introduction of novel proteins. All in all, we can only meet our climate targets if we work together. Universities, startups, corporates and government. Let's make the right choice, the profitable choice.